the camera did die last night, but what happened? I came home to roses. Yeah, you did. Look at it. And they do not look as great as last night because they're obviously not in water and just slowly dying. It was so sweet. Aww, it was so sweet. It was super cute. Definitely need it after a long day that I had. He just knew. I knew. Dallin knew. I knew. You need those flowers. So many here. Look at just takes them to work and like, or takes them to school. What are you doing? Work or school? Both and microblading. So tell us about your first day. It's a long day, that's for sure. Were the kids mean to you? So mean. No. <laughs> no. No, it's gonna be good. It's just a lot of work to do. Sabrina's the F H L A Presidente. That's right. That means she takes care of all the health stuff and make sure people get in jobs and stuff. Isn't that what you do? Don't you give people jobs? I don't know. I just help people like, it's like a club that just helps people that are graduating get more networking. So I come up with events to help network with like actual employers and then students. So I kind of help people get jobs, but I don't know. Just help them network with a bunch of people they need to know. She's a boss, you know? Look at that hat, boss hat. Oh. And a little bit of that. Nice. <laughs> do a close-up on these Ooh. Should we do like a photo shoot right now? Yeah. Lay it down. Huh? No. <laughs> what else is going on today? I'm sleeping over at my grandparents' house tonight, so I'll be gone. You're sleeping somewhere else? <laughs> but what am I gonna do? <laughs> Hopefully the power doesn't go out on you. Hopefully the power does go out, because it was a fun time last night, you know? I liked it. Well, that's sad. Okay, well, stay it there. And then tomorrow we're having a housewarming party with some of my friends. <gasps> a party. Oh my gosh, there's so much to do. Okay, Friday party, today prepare. I have to get everything tonight, won't I? Because tomorrow's the party? What's tomorrow? Friday. Is tomorrow Friday? Heck yeah, it is. And guess what, my eyebrows are really itchy. Oh. Because they're healing. But you can't touch them. You just have to. Yeah. Got Pat, got Pat that weave. <laughs> there you go. You got Pat. Pat that weave. <laughs> yeah. Have another great day at school. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Wish I was coming home to you again. Yeah, this time it would be much darker. Mm. <laughs> All right, Sabrina's gone today, but while she's away, I've decided it's a great day for golfing. Boom. That view is unstoppable. Oh, decide to show up, huh? All right, I'm gonna get my clubs. My clubs first. Now, the thing about Zach and I, we're not like golfers, you know what I mean? Like, we go a fair amount, but neither of us are really tremendous at the game, but we still love to play. In fact, we're so not good that I just bought like a, a bucket of giant 100 golf balls just because we lose them so often. And every time before we go to play, I just grab a handful. We'll get ready. Restock in there. I think we're good. Let's go. Triscuits? You want one? Yeah. Let's just bring them. Jim ginger lemongrass. That sounds nice. Let's try this out. Oh. I don't know, man. Ginger lemongrass isn't my thing, I don't think. They were on sale. The number one reason to buy something you've never tried before. It's on sale. What a view. What a view indeed. Real wind and clouds coming in, no doubt, but Let's see what we can get done. Just before I start, I'm very well aware that there is a giant rip in my pants. It's okay. It's gonna help me golf better. I don't know where it went, but it was in the right direction and the right distance. That was an awesome hit. Woo! Here we go, Zach's turn. Ooh. Oh, hard right. Sand trap. The hardest and most annoying part about golf is trying to find the freaking ball. Because it's not like we're professionals with caddies around here. I think the majority of our time is literally just spent driving around in circles and walking around looking for where the ball is. Found it. 
right there, right in the sand trap, and I am right up there. That guy's ball just landed three feet from me. Not bad. Not bad chip in. Not a bad chip in over here. Sacks in the sand again. And that's for par. Oh, did you hit a house? You hit a house? I mean, what does possess a person to get a house right by a golf course in line to be hit by balls? It's gotta suck. Does insurance cover that or how do they get that paid for? They're just SOL. Sucks. Crazy dogs, crazy dogs showing up out of nowhere. You're lucky they didn't tear your face off. Why well, Reiners? I love them. What are you guys doing? All right, see ya. good to see you. It's a good hit, but look at this. How are you? Let me love you. I think you would like a Trisket. Did you land right next to its head? Yeah. We're gonna find out. Do rabbits eat Triscuits? So far, they do not. Doesn't seem to care at all about your Triscuit. What's that mean about us? Should we not eat them? No. No, we should not. All right, rabbits don't eat Triscuits. Myth busted. Correction. Rabbits do eat Triscuits. Totally eating the Triscuit. And that's it. It's over. I won. <laughs> I mean, he might have, actually. I don't know. I lost fewer balls than down. That's probably the game we were playing, and if that was the case, then yeah, he may have. Now it's time to go shopping. We got stuff to pick up for the party tomorrow. We'll call that a good evening of golf. On my way home, decided to drop off by Dead Bath & Beyond, and I'm pretty sure this is like the second time in my entire life I've been in this store, and it is wild. Like, look at all this stuff. A natural fabric softener? Doubt it. Oh my gosh, I love this cow picture. I need that. So many cool things. The problem is, I'm here like 20 minutes before it closes, so I've gotta get, I gotta get in and get out. And I don't even really remember what I came in for. Oh, pillows, that's right, pillows. Here's pillows. Ooh, these look like bed pillows, so I need like couch, I need like throw pillows. Do they have those here? There's so much stuff. How do we buy so, like, it's just ridiculous to me that there's so much crap. Oh, I found them. Yes. Yes. That's so satisfying. Nice. Got him. Oh. <laughs> Somebody had already done that right above mine. Unoriginal. That seems pretty nice. Yeah, not as nice. Oh yeah, now we're talking. Nice. I feel like I need Sabrina here to tell me which color to get because she's pretty picky on this. I mean, I didn't know I needed it. But part of me feels like I do now. I'm not paying $17 for a can opener. Like, that's basic and it's $14. I'll bite them open before I'll pay $14 for a can opener. Now we're talking. Yeah. Just think it's not that I'm cheap, it's that I don't value can openers, so therefore I'm not willing to spend the money on it. But five dollars, I can do that. How cool are these? These coasters are so cool. I like this one. Oh yeah. How much is this? Twenty hundred dollars. It's fifty dollars each. We're talking one of these guys, a coaster. It's fifty dollars. What is wrong with people? I'm dumbfounded. Disgusted, actually. We need a doormat. I really like that one. I decided to buy him. And although I did also decide that I don't feel like I like Bed Bath & Beyond, I mean, it was still kind of fun to walk through it. I'm not gonna lie. How can there be so much stuff? That's only one store. Where does it all go? Not everyone buys everything. It's all going to get thrown away eventually. There's just too much stuff in this world. Too. Much. Stuff. I don't know if I can do it. I think I might keep the mustache. <laughs> At least for like a little bit. I'm kind of dead serious. 
Sabrina will kill me. And by the way, it's weird to see my face again. Really, really weird. Look at this. I think I'm gonna rock the mustache. Straight up, it's just gonna happen.